clearly I'm on drugs. Just kidding. I'm not on drugs, but um, I'm, I'm on one because I have plans today. I know. Oh my God. Thank you so much. I actually am leaving the house. I'm leaving my house. I understand. I look like I have a mullet. <laughs> you, don't have to, you don't have to remind me, bitch. Anyways, I'm about to get ready. I'm going to go to my friend Jessie. She lives in a really awesome part of town. And then we're going to go to a brewery. Oh, hey. I just realized if you are underage or have never heard of a brewery, you probably have no idea what I'm talking about. So basically what a brewery is, is it, it, it it's, it's hard to say. I'm not going to lie. But basically, it's a place where you can go and drink a lot of beer on tap and chill with your friends, have a seat, play cornhole, play card games. They sometimes have food trucks there. It's an overall swell time. Okay, bye. Hey guys, so y'all want to see my hair? Oh my god, I look like a freak. Oh, OTD. Oh. We're about to get ready to go. <sighs> hey guys, so I'm sitting where I usually film. Turn on my ring light. I'm gonna like try to look okay. Gonna like work on the appearance. I don't know. I'm just like feeling it. But first things first, you know what we're about to do. I'm doing it dry, which kind of hurts. So I'm not going to do much. It's just like we're doing things tonight and I'm going to take you along with me. I'm breaking out though. Look at that. Yeah, my hair does look like shit. I understand. But we're in a phase where we're letting it grow out. Phase where we're... Are you joking? We're letting it grow out. It just doesn't get any better. Uh, so I thought I looked real good until I looked in the viewfinder. We're just gonna we're gonna roll with it. So let's go. I'm ready for the day. I'm ready for the day. Also, we cannot forget the hair on the um, hair tie. Hey guys, so for this next part, my mom randomly wanted to film me taking her spaghetti casserole out of the oven. Don't know why, just sort of roll with it. <laughs> yeah, yum. Gosh, I love horses. <laughs> French press, the best for me. God, it's hot. So for this part, I tried to record myself dancing the Mac Miller because R.I.P. But then I heard one of her roommates come down the stairs, so I had to stop. <laughs> Yaga. Hey guys, what's up? I'm swinging, swinging. Hello. Yes, it's hot. These are my friends. Oh my god, my best friends. Holy shit. Are you guys getting married? Yeah. <laughs> so he's sitting outside. We we pissed him off. I can't. <laughs> When's the wedding? <laughs> I'm a city girl. I drive like a city girl. Shut <laughs> up. I drive like a city girl because we're in the city. You bitches. Thank yeah, like you. But alcohol. alcohol. Smells like a white. <laughs> cheers um, to, to teen angst and teen love. To the teen angst. Che cheers to the weekend, everybody. Yeah, <laughs> So around this point, there were some people who arrived to the brewery in those bird scooters. And once you abandon the scooters, they're no longer yours. They're up for grabs. My friend Jesse and I decided to mess around in the brewery parking lot on bird scooters. Because not only are we almost 23, we're, we're young teenagers at heart, baby. She's going so fast. She doesn't know how to stop. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Go ahead. Ruin their game of cornhole. <laughs> Bruh. Christ. See ya. She's literally leaving us. Goodbye. See you never. She's literally leaving us. There she is, living her best freaking life. So here's my friend Jesse and I playing foosball, who's clearly beasting at me. Yes, okay. And then all of a sudden, this dumb, weird painting falls on me. Like, am I that much of a Bigfoot? Where like paintings just fall on me? Bruh. Hey guys! Hey guys! <laughs> bruh, 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 bruh. <laughs> so we are looking for birds officially. We're gonna find birds and we're gonna run them. We're gonna we're gonna ride them all around Atlanta and no one can stop us. <laughs> you think that one, sis? <laughs> 
Update, we're dying, help. I wish I was fake breathing in this next clip, but unfortunately, I'm not. <sighs> we have been walking for 30 minutes trying to yep. find those stupid scooters. Yep. We are sweating, That's we are okay. tired. I keep farting because we see the fucking birds. No one's fucking taking these. I see one. This app is so bad. We've literally been running all over Atlanta trying to find them. And I, hababa, hababa, I have about had it. I have had it. Hey guys, so to sum it all up, my friend Jesse and I basically walked around downtown and midtown of Atlanta, Georgia, trying to find those bird scooters. We used the app to find and locate birds, but every time we would go to the location that said that they had birds, the birds wouldn't be there. We got bamboozled by that map. So the next clip you're about to see is Jesse and I walking home after being defeated and finding a bird. However, after 9 p.m. every night, the birds become inactive. So it was too late for us, you know. Uh, I hate, I hate big corporations like you. Gotta go. Yeah, shut up. My phone's on 1%, my feet hurt, and life be like that. We walked. My, it hurts to say. We are so sweaty. We walked for two miles <laughs> in the 90 degree evening <laughs> to find those <laughs> scooters. And every single one we came across was broken, occupied. They lied on the map. My recommendation is I look like Lord Farquaad for sure. And I've been farting all day. Hey there. So I look like a wreck, but I thought it was funny because I'm leaving my friends now. I'm walking down the street. It's midnight. I have one shoe in my hand and I'm walking without another shoe. Honestly, pathetic. What is going on? I'm back home and I am hurting and i also left one shoe in the car hey dudes so it is time for bed i'm showered i did something in the shower today that i don't normally do and that is brush my teeth not too sure how i feel about it we'll give you a full consensus tomorrow morning um if i remember <laughs> yeah i'm just chilling in bed thinking about life reflecting on my day i remember this time last year i not to get too deep or whatever i like really hated my life and i hated myself and i hated everything about my life and I thought everyone in my life hated me and I did not feel love but that could not be farther from the truth and I was just so blinded by my own self-hatred and depression and shit when that whole time everyone did love me I was loved yes when you really stop to smell the motherfucking roses <laughs> stop I'm a stop. I'm a, I'm a stop. When you really stop and think about it, like the people in your life do love you. It's just the way that you perceive love when you're in such a negative mindset can like be kind of toxic or whatever. I cannot see myself because I'm filming on my back camera with the freaking flash burning my retinas. But it's not like I don't look at my phone screen at all hours of the day. So like how much you want to bet because of all the looking that we do at our phones, our retinas are like age times 10. When we're like 70 or 80, we will be bland. Food for thought, baby. It's the government. <laughs> and I hope you have a good night. Kawabunga. Remember that. Surf's up. Peace and love and love and peace. See ya. Guys, so it's the morning time and I'm having coffee. And I really wanted froth milk, but I did have a frother. And so I was thinking, what can I do? And I came up with a solution for you. All you do is take your milk. Right here I have almond breeze, almond milk. And this is all you have to do to froth your milk. <laughs> Ta-da, you have the frothed milk for your coffee. <laughs> There's someone in the parking spot right next to me who is just in her car too. And we're both just chilling in our cars, a few feet away from each other, which is fine. So what the heck is going on? Oh, she's about to get out. Good. Scat. <laughs> Okay, she's gone. <laughs> I'm sitting in the parking lot of an appointment that I have, but I am like 30 minutes early. I look somewhat decent today, I'm not even gonna lie. And I thought I would pop on. I was driving here and I saw that someone had, you know those tires that are like on back of Jeep, on the back of Jeeps? On their like tire cover it said, not all who wander are lost. I don't know why that's so funny, but it freaking resonated with me, man. Like, not all who wonder are last. I'm not sure if this is TMI, but I think I scratched the top of my butthole. Oh, that was whoever is up there saying, don't tell that story. I love sitting in my car and just like decompressing. So that's good. Yep, that's right. I got these new glasses. Yeah, I just got my eyes dilated. 
<coughs> oh my god, I'm gonna throw up. I'm waiting for my bitch Azure to come get me. We're gonna go to Sweet Hut. Hope. Um, Sweet Hut is like this chain bakery in Atlanta that is. <gasps> hey guys, so I didn't do an outro for this video. If you're wondering what I got from Sweet Hut, I got a bubble tea. It looks like this. I just want to say thank you so much for watching, and I'm leaving you with this quote. And I hope you take that and you just wrap it up in yourself and you just love it. Um, okay. Yeah, thanks for watching.